What's up football fans, today I bring to you the top 10 football players of all time. These footballers are the best of the best, and we will be comparing them to see the top 10 best players and who is the number one best player of all time. And consider subscribing to help me reach 1000 subscribers, I would really appreciate it. And now, let's get into it. At number 10, we have Franz Beckenbauer. He initially started his career as a midfielder, but later became a central defender. He won the World Cup as a player in 1974 and as a coach in 1990. While playing at Bayern Munich, he led them to three Euro Cups and four Bundesliga titles, making him the 10th on the list. Moving on to number 9, we have Ronaldinho. Known for his tricks, overhead kicks, and dribbling, winning two back-to-back -back FIFA World Player of the Year awards, and winning the bronze medal with Brazil Olympic football team at the 2008 Olympic Games. And we can't forget about his beautiful smile. At number 8, we have Ronaldo. No, not Cristiano Ronaldo, the original Ronaldo. He became the World Cup's greatest scorer in 2006, scoring 15 goals, winning numerous Ballon d'Ors, Golden Shoes, and World Cups. He would probably be the best player in the world, if not for his constant knee injuries. Moving on to number 7, we have Alfredo Di Stefano. He is considered the most complete footballer in the history of football. Di Stefano was even awarded 5 European Cups and 8 La Liga titles. Pelé once said, quote, People argue between Pelé or Maradona, Di Stefano is the best, much more complete and that comes directly from Pelé. At number 6, we have Zinedine Zidane. Winning one Ballon d'Or and three FIFA World Player of the Year awards, he was amazing. He was the only player to be named Player of the Year in the three of the top five leagues, and later becoming the coach of Real Madrid, he is continuing to shine. At number 5, we have Johan Cruyff. He's literally the player who invented modern football as we know it today. He even invented his own skill move, and he is considered the most influential football player of all time. Winning three Ballon d'Ors, awarded a three-time Dutch Footballer of the Year, and even winning three European Cups and one La Liga title, but did you know that he did not even start playing football until the age of 15? At number 4, we have Diego Maradona. Unfortunately, he has recently died on November 25th, 2020, but he was remembered as a legend of football. Named the best athlete in history and leading Argentina to win the World Cup in 1986, he is remembered as one of the best footballers ever. At number 3, we have Cristiano Ronaldo. Having won 5 Ballon d'Ors, 4 Golden Boots, and scoring 660 career club goals in 875 matches, he is unstoppable. He's even the first player in the history of football to score more than 50 goals in a season for 6 consecutive years. And at number 2, we have Lionel Messi. He is the GOAT, the legend, and just an exceptionally amazing player. He has won the Ballon d'Or 6 times. Now what keeps Messi from not being the best player on this list is that he has never won the FIFA World Cup, although that does not keep him from being a legend. So finally, the number one best player to ever play football is Pele. He's the best player to ever stand foot onto the field, and he's the three-time World Cup winner. He has officially scored over 1,000 goals, and no other footballer has ever scored more goals than Pele. Winning the FIFA Player of the Century and having the most assists in FIFA World Cup history, even the Time Magazine named him as one of the 100 most important people of the 20th century. And that'll be it for this video. These are the top 10 best football players of all time. Make sure you are subscribed for more videos just like this. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.